Next step in Britain's phone hacking scandal could soon be in the courtrooms here in the United States. There is a British attorney who is ready to sue Rupert Murdoch on behalf of three clients who may have been hacked in the United States. We'll talk with Mark Lewis in a moment, but first, Mark Phillips looks at how this one attorney helped break open the hacking case. The legal thorn in the Murdoch media empire's side and the man now considering bringing charges in the United States is a man who was a regular reader of the company's most notorious newspaper. The news of the world has since been shut down, a casualty of the phone hacking scandal. After Rupert Murdoch's News International finally admitted the paper had systematically hacked into the voicemail messages of a missing teenager named Millie Dowler, giving her parents false hope that she was alive when in fact she had been murdered. Mark Lewis, a previously unknown English lawyer, represented the Dowler family and led the legal battle which forced the Murdochs to pay almost $5 million in compensation and also forced Rupert Murdoch to apologize. Yes, he did apologize. He apologized many times. I don't think somebody could have held their hands in the head in their hands so many times to say that they were sorry. The damage to the Murdoch empire has been more than an embarrassing pie in the face for the company's patriarch. James Murdoch, the son and heir apparent, has since been ousted, or at least jumped before he was pushed, from his top job in the family business. The Murdochs used private eye Derek Webb to try to discredit Mark Lewis, and they have underestimated him. They don't do that anymore. For CBS This Morning, I'm Mark Phillips in London.